Hey everybody, it's Chris and Des Show. I'm Chris. And I'm Des. And today we're going to talk to you about the new Marvel film, Doctor Strange, in theaters right now. Uh, Des, what did you think? Loved it! <laughs> Loved every minute of it! Oh, it was so good. Okay, Marvel just knows what they're doing. Mm -hmm. And can, so here's another like beginning story, a beginning character, an obscure character in the Marvel Universe. Uh, he's magical. He's more... Uh, uh, to deal with the supernatural and the the spiritual, more more of that kind. I don't know if that's a good way to describe it, but it's not so black and white. Anyway, uh, it's an origin story, which is my favorite kind of story. And it's an obscure character, so it's not anything that I had any... I didn't know what it was going in. Like, everybody knows who Batman is and how he became Batman. I didn't know how Doctor Strange became Doctor Strange because I don't read Marvel comic books. I don't know anything about him. But, and so here it was, and it was so well done. They just do, they just know what they're doing. And so my assumption is that they needed that character for the next big Avenger movie or something. So they're planning ahead, and they're setting the groundwork, and they're saying, here, let's introduce you to this character so we can incorporate him in the next movie so we can use him to fight the bad guy and so they're planning and I love how they plan and it was just really I always thought it was so good and uh what's his name Cumberbatch Benedict, Cumberbatch. Benedict. he's awesome he's wonderful what did you think I I loved it I loved it too and I um Speaking kind of what you were saying, my talked to my dad about it. My dad loves Marvel comics oh. more than DC, so he's the other side. Yeah, I'm a um, DC girl. <clears throat> the movie says, "No, their movies. <laughs> I will admit, their movies are uh, not." It they're... makes you. It makes you really like Marvel comics. The movies yeah. too, because you're like, yeah. "Oh, well, these are good." I love the Marvel. Movies. I was telling my dad, like, "Oh, they talked about the Avengers a lot in this movie." He's like. He's one of the Avengers. I'm like, oh, got it. Oh, see, got it. didn't, I didn't know, know that, that. But yeah. But okay, good, good. That good. makes sense. <laughs> like, know, all right? makes sense to yeah. me. Um, uh, but it is just, it is just a great movie. It doesn't matter if you like comic book movies or it not. Really it's just doesn't. a really it's well a made, well movie. made, good story. Uh, one of, one of my favorite movies of this year so far, for sure. Um, and Benedict Cumberbatch is fantastic as Doctor Strange. He's just a likable guy. It's very funny at times. Uh, it's got action at, at different times. But a good storyline. That is the difference between Marvel movies and DC movies is the storyline. It just They know how to get well, a good story going. takes the time to get you to know this guy. Mm -hmm. Like they take the time from the beginning to say, look, he's this arrogant doctor and he's really full of himself. And look how he is mm -hmm. and who he is and what he values. And then all this happens. Yeah. And so it's so good. So good. And Chiwetel Ejiofor is fantastic in it. I like him a lot. Rachel McAdams and Benedict Wong. Tilda Swinton is like the ancient one in this movie. Uh, and they're all, they're all really good. <clears throat> and so it was just good movie all around. Great special effects. Great. Just a great movie. Amazing. Just a really it's good movie. Really Go good. see it. Everyone yeah. will like it. Sure. Uh, it's rated PG-13 because of the violence and probably a few crude Chris jokes. I don't even remember his name. But, um, but it's like a typical Marvel movie like the Avengers and like that. It's so great. You'll it's enjoy it. Good. You'll enjoy it. Yes. Bye.